Well, before we went into this game, we had it behind our mind that um, we played against Kotoko six times. They've beaten us four times and then we beat them twice. So we went into this game not to make it 5-2, but to make it 4-3. Four, uh, four, but uh, we, were, we held on on the objective of why we are playing them to beat them. And then we had it very good with them, tit uh, tit it was okay. Tactically, we all show that we've really been under good coaches. So when we came in for the second half and then we had a goal, that is when our problem started. So uh, we lost concentration and we didn't take the advantage of the five substitutes. And Kotoko took that advantage and then they punished us. That's what I saw for the first uh, 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 the match against Kotoko. They took the advantage of the five substitution to punish us, and we did not take that ad advantage. So when when they brought fresh limbs, they were on us to at that level, our boys. And then again, one thing also that did not help us was the cars given to us almost. Five players had cast. So when they were weaving through closer to our 18, the boys were afraid to go in because they had behind their mind that they've been given yellow cast and nobody want to miss that game. So that also is another factor that punishes. Yes, we could not because when they brought the fresh limb, they were coming on us like nobody's uh, business. So instead of us to calm the, 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 the game down, we also tried to counter, which was very wrong. Uh, during that time, I even called uh, one of the players, that is Kakari, and then told him we should not rush, because they are in with about three fresh limbs. So we should calm down and then do the uh, uh, game management in order to waste the time. Because when you look at the time, 82, 83, we were leading. So it was around 84 when they came in, into the game and then they so, I can say we, we, we did not uh, 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 do well to do the man, uh, game management. If we had applied the game management, we we'll would have won the game. Well, I think it's a big lesson to us. Now, uh, football is full of uh, constant failure. Uh, and then the best thing about it is you always have time to improve upon what and nobody knows anything about uh, or nobody can hit each other and said i know everything about football no you can't but at the end of the day that is why it's called a game a game of football you can't predict what happened but you can use today's match to enhance tomorrow's game so now what i've seen now is we should leave this one aside and then concentrate on the rest of the matches and then plan well to be able to get a good results. The preparation is winning we, because we should have won uh, against Kotoko because it's home. So now that we, if we had won, I would say we do our best to beat them or to draw. But now it's winning at all costs. That is the mentality we are going to take it there. So that we make the amendments of losing home. Now, because when you are going to play the league, you sit down and assess the league there are certain matches you don't have to lose. There are certain matches you can even predict draw. And then with Kotoko and Haas, it's everybody's game. So at least if we were to have a draw with them, it will help us. In so now, it means we've lost our three points at home. We should go and then away and then have the three points so that it will square the one we lost against Kotoko. This is what we are, the, the, the brain behind what we are going to do on on Sunday against Elmina Jans.